Okay, Dave, uh, I guess just get into a little bit of what you guys are doing here, uh, tournaments, you know, a couple months out, you guys are here just checking out the gardens. Uh, yeah, so I came here in the summer to do a little bit of site visit, meet the host organized community, so I'm doing my second visit today, hosting meetings, uh, finalizing a lot of the plans, uh, you know, hotels, meals, uh, travel arrangements, uh, dressing room assignments, and overall logistics of the area. What are your thoughts on the gardens? It's got character. It's uh, it's gonna be a good barn, and we're hoping to pack it every night. So yeah, tell us a bit about what goes into uh, preparing for a tournament like this year. Uh, so once we award the bid, uh, the event to uh, say Thunder Bay, we go over business plans, ticketing plans, marketing plans, and overall legacy. So the overall goal for us is to create positive hockey experiences for the fans, the players, and the stakeholders in the event and also leave an overall legacy behind. So all the money made uh, from the telescope will be staying in Thunder Bay and the surrounding areas and going to local programming. How many people do you guys expect this to bring into the city of Thunder Bay? Uh, it's, you know, with uh, over 150 uh, player, uh, players from across the country and then, you know, we obviously have uh, fans that travel the country to attend this event uh, year after year. So we expect uh, a good number, you know, plus parents, uh, well over a thousand, like a uh, thousand uh, people just for teams alone and then fans, hopefully a lot more. Talk about the importance of this tournament. Uh, you know, the, this, uh, the TELUS Cup at some point, you know, you see a lot of these top prospects, you know, you'll see them move on, move on in hockey, but you know what, sometimes for the, a lot of these players, it's the pinnacle of their career, and you know what? We want to make sure that we, they have a great time here in Thunder Bay, and overall, just make sure they worry about what they do on the ice. Can you tell us a bit about what uh, what it was about Thunder Bay's bid that, that got in this tournament? Uh, you know, it's the overall like hosting experience that they've had, and you know, a venue, people, planning, business plan, and just overall uh, experience of, uh, in the history of this town. Is there anything you're going to be having to do to prepare the gardens to host this tournament? Oh yeah, there's going to be lots of change over. Uh, we've got to, you know, put up some pageantry items. We've got to uh, prepare dressing rooms and uh, a lot of those little minor things. Uh, but uh, overall, just make it a hockey can experience and make sure everything's up to our standards and uh, just put on a good show.